In order to make multiple designs, you know, to repeat designs, there is this button here on the left hand side. It's L6 and if you press that, you have the ability to do design repetition. And here we're going to do automatic creation of new design table. So we'll press this. And then here you can choose what design you want to use. Um, so you can just scroll up and down with your arrows here. Uh, you know, choose a design. We'll select that design. And now we have different um, values that we can set. This is going to be the width of the area in millimeters. This is going to be the height of the area in millimeters. This is going to be your margin, uh, your, you know, your vertical margin right here, as well as on the left hand side. Then you've got your, your uh, horizontal margins at the bottom and at the top. And then you have the spacing between each design. You've got your horizontal spacing and then vertical spacing. So if we go through here, uh, right now you can see it's highlighted on 250. I'm going to change this to 300. And as soon as I hit the tab key, I'll go to the next value. See the next value will highlight. Again, I'll hit 300. Hit tab. The next value pops up here. I'll just do 25. Tab. 25. Tab. 25 and 25 and I'll hit tab again and then I've got my horizontal space I will do 20 here I'll hit the tab key and do 20 and once I'm finished with all these settings I'll hit continue and in here it shows you how it's going to fill it's going to go from left to right down from right to left, down, from left to right, down. Um, there's your starting needle. And if you want the maximum amount of designs in the area you chose, I would just keep it at 9999. We'll go ahead and hit continue. And when we hit continue, that's the amount of designs I can fit in that area. I'll go ahead and save this design and I'll put it in a free design number. Confirm that. And we'll go ahead and previous. Then I will pull up my design from the file cabinet. We'll confirm that. And we'll select this design, it's a design table. And now you can see my two designs and that's my start point. So that's how we um, do multiple designs on the T8 controller.